And today we're going to show you how to use the very cool, easy to learn date diff function in Excel 2016. Here's your situation. In just two months, your company will have its annual service award party to recognize employees who have hit 10, 15, and 25 years of continuous service. As a member of the Human Resources Department, it's your responsibility to identify the service award recipients and to give their names to the general manager this afternoon. Using this employee information report, and the date diff function in Excel 2016 will help you to easily organize your report. As you can see, the information report gives us the employee's full name in column A and their hire dates in column B. The first thing you must do is to use the today function to complete column C with today's dates. To do this, write an equal sign in cell C6. Then type the word today, followed by an open and close parentheses. Here's the formula for this. Now press enter and the today function fills in the current date automatically. Now drag the formula and fill in all of column C. Then you need to determine each employee's years of service in column D. Don't worry, the date diff function will perform the complicated math for you. All you have to do is write an equal sign in cell D6, then type the word date diff followed by an open parenthesis. Now select the higher date in cell B6 followed by a comma. Then write the word today with an open and closed parenthesis followed by a comma. Now type an open quotation mark, then type the letter Y for years and a closed quotation mark. Now type a close parenthesis and press enter. Here's the formula. Then drag the formula and see the years of service for every employee has been calculated by the date diff function.